Here's the field for the night's 11th race. Feature race of the night. Open one pacers racing a mile. Purse of $7,500. The one is Mountain Jackson, owned by Paul Humphrey. Kelly Darrow, Keith Noble, and Dave Miller. Dave Miller drives. The two is Suburbanite, owned by David Cooper and Gene Hall. Herbie Browner. Three is Touch of Greatness, so with the Chester Stable and the Cappy Stable with Bruce Regal. Number four, I Carl's WAG, owned by Carl Gregg of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Jeff out of the bike. Five Pilgrims Fiery, owned by James Taylor of Troy, Ken Holliday in the Salt Gate. Win, play, show, perfect the trifecta wagering. Eight minutes. Eleven race open pacers are on the back stretch. There they go. And they're off, and Pilgrim's Fiery pushing the gate away for the late touch of greatness. From the side of the track is away second. Suburbanite from the inside is third. Inside, racing a fourth. By Carl's WAG. The early trailer is the little horse, Mountain Jackson. Short field of five, but they're all strung out as they reach the first quarter mile marker. Pilgrim's Fiery setting the early pace here by four. Touch of Greatness on the inside is second. First top, 27 seconds. Suburbanite off the big mile last week is racing third. Like Carl's WAG is fourth. Mountain Jackson is a sluggish fifth as they race to the stretch. Pilgrim's Fiery, Holiday, reining him in, looking to conserve here, leading by two and a half, three. Inside, touch of greatness is a patient second. Suburbanite. Under the inside is third. I Carl's WAG fourth. Half and 56 and three. Pilgrim's Fiery continues to front the field as they race down the back stretch. Inside, touch of greatness. Regal is still waiting second. Suburbanite. To the outside, looking to draw cover now, and does. And there goes Touch of Greatness, and Suburbanite gets the job done, has his cover, he is racing a third. I Carl's WAG will take a straight shot up in the pocket, fourth. Three quarters at 125, the race begins from here. Pilgrims fire with the lead. Touch of Greatness right there alongside. But Suburbanite on the outside, yet to have his presence known. Less than an eighth of a mile ago, and down the stretch they come. Touch of Greatness with the lead. Suburbanite, Ike Carl's WAG into traffic again. No racing room, but Suburbanite on the outside. And Suburbanite will get up to take it in 153 and 3. And here is the winner of this evening's feature race. Number two, Suburbanite, six year old son of Big Tanner from Bunny Hanover. David Cooper and Gene Hall of Ohio and Kentucky. David Cooper trains, Herbie Brown driving. Seventh season's victory for the six-year-old of Pacer. A mile 153 and three, very impressive effort tonight.